Good afternoon. It's with great pleasure that I welcome you all, family and friends, as we come together to celebrate a new life. A beautiful baby boy, Riley Jacob Sterling. Thank you all for being here. My name is Irene Martindale and I'm a celebrant officiating today's ceremony. Today we mark a milestone, not only for Riley, but for his mum and dad, Calvin and Susie. Riley is a very much longed for child. In fact, Calvin and Susie have waited 10 years for this moment. And so it is with glad hearts and great joy that you are all gathered here today for Riley's naming ceremony. A naming ceremony's purpose is to officially give a baby their name and to make the name known to all family and friends. It also has the extended purpose of celebrating the arrival of a new person to the community the baby will, that the baby will be part of for the rest of his life. We all share in the joy of Riley's arrival, just as we all share the responsibility of shaping him as a person. Riley's parents invite you, their very special friends and family, to share in caring for his needs and good, uh, good influences as he grows and so we offer him our love, knowledge and wisdom. The more people he has in his life, the more balanced and rich his growth will be. So your presence at this celebration today is appreciated, as will be your interest and involvement in the years ahead. Riley as a name means valiant, and it is our hope that Riley grows up and lives his life with honor, courage and determination. A name is very important. It distinguishes us from others and gives us a sense of belonging in our family and community. Calvin and Susie have chosen the middle name Jacob because this is the name of Riley's great-grandfather and it ensures the carrying on of a tradition within the family. Grandpa Jacob is very pleased and hopes that one day Riley will also include his name when he has his own sons. He is also very happy to see that Riley has inherited the same beautiful red hair and blue eyes that he has. Riley, your name has been chosen with love and a strong sense of history. We therefore name you Riley Jacob Sterling Brown. We wish you long life and happiness in a loving and peaceful world. May you bring joy to your parents, your family and your friends. Susie has a poem that she would like to share with you. It is her mother Jenny's favorite poem and she would like to read it. It is called Wishes for a Child by Joanne Miller. May you know the gift of friendship, feel the sun upon your face. May you win displaying dignity and accept defeat with grace. May you marvel with the wonders of nature and the earth. May you value education and know your own true worth. May you live and love with honesty and do the thing that's right. May you stand up for the homeless and sleep in peace at night. May you thrive upon a challenge and sing and dance and laugh. May you know the joy of parenthood and follow your own path. Thank you, Susie. Susie and Calvin, this little person has come into your lives and changed them forever. So I ask you now to make your own personal declaration of love to him. Please repeat after me, Susie. Riley, I promise to love you unconditionally. Riley, I promise to love you unconditionally. Cherish and nurture. Cherish and nurture. You throughout your life. You throughout your life. I promise to do my best to raise you. I promise to do my best to raise you. To be the best kind of person that you can be. To be the best kind of person that you can be. And Calvin. Riley, I promise to love you unconditionally. Riley, I promise to love you unconditionally. To cherish and nurture you throughout your life. To cherish and nurture you throughout your life. I promise to do my best to raise you. I promise to do my best to raise you. To be the best kind of person that you can be. To be the best kind of person that you can be. Promises for the guardians. Mum and Dad, 
have asked Uncle Sam and Uncle Tom to be the guardians for Riley. Please could you join me at the front? Sam and Tom, you've been chosen by Calvin and Susie to be Riley's guardians. It is a testament of their trust in you to be asked to do this. So now I formally ask you both, will you stay close to Riley for as long as you both live? We do. Will you help guide him through life so that he learns the best of all you know? We do. Will you teach him to be kind, to always respect each other, and to be the best person he can be? We do. Calvin and Susie, we will now light a candle in honour of Riley. This symbolises that he is now part of one big family. So parents and guardians, as the flame flickers through bright, may this signify the light that you will bring into Riley's life. On behalf of Calvin and Susie, I would like to thank you for your attendance and for the gifts that you have given Riley. There are refreshments outside with a special table of goodies for Riley's big cousins. Please stay if you can and toast Riley's naming ceremony with them. Thank you. Right. Pass the baby. And then we'll light the candle. Take two. 